cả dân ở đây thì họ là các nơi đến đây các tỉnh đến đây họ không có đất không có đai không có gì cả chỉ có mỗi là con người được cái nhà phao trên thuyền để ở để mà cuộc làm cuộc sống ở đây thôi people who live here there are over 100 people um, are amongst the poorest in Hanoi and in Vietnam in general and since starting this project two years ago our aim has been to improve the lives of everybody who lives here à, bà tên là à, Đào Thị Phương Nga năm nay 567 tuổi và sống tại ở bãi giữa sông Hồng này thì là bà sống ở đây là 30 năm rồi Thế, đi sống thì đi làm chỉ nhặt rác nhặt viết thôi Ê, thì bây giờ già rồi thì bây giờ cũng chả làm gì việc nữa thế cả thì bây giờ về gọi là trông cháu đưa cháu đi học thì hoàn cảnh của bà thì bây giờ là phải nuôi ba người ba miệng ăn thì bố với mẹ nó bỏ hết đi rồi đấy bố mẹ nó bỏ hết đi là mình phải nuôi thôi With this project, our students are fully involved from the very start. We get our students to visit here on a regular basis throughout the school year. Our students then meet all the locals that live here. They get to discuss, they get to find out what the locals need from us and, and our support system. And then the students are fully involved in the planning and then action stage of ensuring that what we do here maximizes the potential for these, for the people who need it. The students this year have been uh, doing many activities. The first activity is clearing the litter and trash from the local area. They've also then been doing lots of gardening where they've been helping plant crops and weed the unwanted plants to ensure that people have a regular supply of food and income. They've also then been uh, building and decorating a new school playground for all the children um, who live here to enjoy. As soon as we set foot in the village, we got the sense that the people here really needed our help. And being from India, a tool that cares a lot about service learning and helping others, we felt that we could implement really long-term changes that can you know, really improve the living standards. Oh, we have the opportunity to observe the lives of poor people here, but we also have a chance to pick up trash, for example, also um, painting small equipment for the playground. We also make compost for plants, and last but not least, we um, know how to plant trees. I have learned so many things, and I believe that more people have learned uh, from all of these events that the school have made for us. For instance, we know how fortunate we are by observing um, the lives of people who have difficulties um, and we just know it motivates all of these events, motivates us to do something for the community um, and we have the opportunity to uh, helping them from a very small things. Through the service learning program, I learned to have a different view from the normal city's perspective. I learned to help the people in need, to spread the message that you could also help them too through donations, through physical activities, community, such as helping them plant crops, painting their playground for the children, and helping them make composters for their plants. My life is that every day I eat at home. Nói thường chia sẻ nhà, nhưng mà nhà thì cũng làm khá lâu rồi, mình nhà trên mặt nước thì cũng rất là nguy hiểm. Nên được sự, bây giờ được cái sự giúp đỡ của các, các cháu ở đây và sửa sang lại nhà cửa thì rất là tuyệt vời. Và xin cảm ơn tất cả các cháu mà có cái lòng hảo tâm để đến giúp bà con. Khác với các cái dự án mang tính thiện nguyện, uh, mang đến um, trao tặng cho cộng đồng thì ở đây các bạn đã tạo dựng ra các cái giá trị mang tính lâu bền hơn và giúp cho cộng đồng cải thiện về chất lượng cuộc sống và uh, uh, và môi trường sống tại khu vực này. As a school community, we have successfully raised over four thousand dollars for projects related to the Philippine village, and we hope in the future to continue our support for it. Furthermore, last year we got support from the social impact grant. 
which awarded us with seventeen thousand uh, dollars to invest into more projects within the village. With that grant, we commit to investing at least sixteen thousand dollars into the renewal of the village's houses, the community library, the community garden, and the community playground, especially for the children, give them a better life. Moving forward, we plan to improve the infrastructure here, to building roads, to improve the transportation within the village and outside of it. Uh, we also plan to help uh, further these infrastructures, such as playground and garden, and other furthermore.